Professor Jack Rusmus with the latest on our economy and now to the details of the Jamal Khashoggi tape. It's emerged. Apparently he's heard on this tape crying for help while his killers are heard screaming, traitor, you're gonna, you will be brought to account. All leads point right now to the appearance that the screamers were Saudis and that the job was ordered by the crown prince of Saudi Arabia. Nonetheless, President Trump says he's still unsure. Mr. Trump assured what is most important here is that special relationship with Saudi Arabia. It must continue for the sake of the world's economy. With more on this, here's RT's Dan Cohen. President Trump released a statement all but pardoning Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman for his alleged role in the murder of Jamal Khashoggi. He spoke about it outside the White House. Because it's America first for me. It's all about America first. We're not going to give up hundreds of billions of dollars in orders and let Russia, China, and everybody else have them. It's all about, for me, very simple. It's the White House statement mostly attacks Iran for supposed terrorism. Five paragraphs in, it gets to the heart of the matter, saying, quote, King Salman and Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman vigorously deny any knowledge of the planning or execution of the murder of Mr. Khashoggi. Trump once again cast doubt on the CIA's version of events. He added, we may never know all of the facts surrounding the murder of Mr. Jamal Khashoggi. In any case, our relationship is with the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Trump's statement ended with something of an asterisk, saying, I understand there are members of Congress who, for political or other reasons, would like to go in a different direction, and they are free to do so. I will consider whatever ideas are presented to me, but only if they are consistent with the absolute security and safety of America. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo addressed the press, though he avoided specifically mentioning Mohammed bin Salman. He simply said the special relationship with Saudi Arabia must go on. It is the president's obligation, indeed the State Department's duty as well, to ensure that we adopt policies that further the Amer America's national security. So as the president said today, uh, the United States will continue to have a relationship with the kingdom of Saudi Arabia. They are important. Uh, partner of ours, uh, we, will, we will do that with the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, its people. That is, that is the commitment that the president made today. Trump's statement brought backlash from the national security establishment and Obama administration officials. Former national security advisor Susan Rice tweeted, utter disgrace. Meanwhile, former ambassador to the United Nations Samantha Power said Trump's statement is, quote, a green light for would-be murderers in countries that have things Trump thinks we need. Former CIA agent Ned Price blasted the president, saying, quote, how appointed intelligence leaders could continue to serve after this betrayal is beyond me. The outrage against Trump's less than daft handling of the Khashoggi murder is consistent with a report that Saudi royals and senior U.S. officials are seeking to replace Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman with his uncle, Prince Ahmed. They're supposedly perturbed for human rights violations, but also because the Crown Prince recently urged the Saudi Defense Ministry to explore alternative weapon supplies from Russia, including the S-400 surface-to-air missile system. Saudi Arabia's agreement to buy Russian weapons was made in October 2017, a full year before Khashoggi was murdered. So while U.S. officials were clearly not pleased with that decision, the grisly Khashoggi murder may have been the straw that broke the camel's back. Reporting in Washington, Dan Cohen, RT. Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out our channel. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have tons of content for you just like this. For more of RT America's one-of-a-kind news and analysis, be sure to subscribe and never stop questioning more.